Now, I recently did a review of Norm Attack 22 and how it performed in my Ruger Precision Rimfire, and I'll include a link to that review uh, in the video description. But one of the things I was looking at when I uh, was testing the TAC-22 is I was looking at the box closely to see if it had a, uh, a batch number or a lot number. And I really, look, we were looking at this, I was looking at this super closely. There's nothing on this side, no embossing. Usually there's some sort of embossed or imprinted number, nothing on here. And the only in numbers indicated uh, were on the barcode here. But I know the, this is a barcode number. This is just the, uh, the model uh, or the, the type of ammo this is and, and its name. And perhaps I thought maybe this is a lot number, but it just, it just didn't seem like it would be because it's, it looks like it's printed exactly the same as the barcode. And, you know, the Europeans are pretty good about putting lot numbers. Well, I thought, okay, well, maybe because it's, it's Norma USA, they don't bother with lot or batch numbers. Well, I was wrong. In fact, uh, one of my viewers um, commented and told me where the batch, the lot number was. And it is actually in here, in this flap on the side. So all this time it was here and it's embossed in there. So I was this old when I found out that Norma Tech 22 does have batch and lot numbers. So anyway, thanks for watching. Hope this was helpful. If it was, please hit like and subscribe. Moondog, out.